Hi everyone, thank you so much for tuning in again. This is part two of my series, The Power of People Coming Together and Helping Others. If you've watched my first video, it was me meeting Jason and Jubilee for the first time about three weeks ago and you all were so touched by my video and wanted to support these guys further. So I had a GoFundMe and together we have raised about $800. So thank you so much for everybody who donated. Here is a proof of a video as well that you know your funds went to the person it was intended for, which was Jason and Jubilee. I made two snack packs, one for Jason and one for Jubilee. The one for Jubilee was more in bones and, you know, toys for him to have something on a daily basis that keeps him busy and stimulated and as you can see here he's already munching on a little bone and look at him looking up at me oh my god he's so cute he's a really gentle dog as well for a pit bull so he's never been really aggressive to me so yeah his little bag was a success and jason was really appreciative of that then I got Jason a hygiene kit. I wanted to make sure that he has access to anything that he needs. And I made sure that it was travel size because he only has a cart that he carries around uh, on the street. So I wanted to make sure it's small. And then I got him some dry food that I know will last him a few days or maybe a day but something that is dry and won't go bad so he was super appreciative of that as well and i gave him a gift card as well to a coffee shop so he can go inside somewhere and drink coffee get some food if he needs that and i also got him some shoes and socks because he only had sandals so I gave him a three pack of socks, which he really appreciated and some Hoka shoes. Those are pretty comfortable for walking. So he was super happy about those ones as well. As you can see, he is chatting and being very happy. Most of the time, I actually don't understand what he says and so i tried to just uh listen and be a good listener and this is me demonstrating how the kong works so i got a few squeezable peanut butters that he can just screw open and then squeeze into the kong i have that for my dogs as well and Jubilee really liked it too so it was a win-win and the other day when I walked past he was playing with his Kong and was having some peanut butter my husband also noticed that Jason's cart wheels were broken so we ordered him a new cart which should arrive this week and I will post a video once we deliver it to him overall I just wanted to say thank you to the community and everyone who donated and supported me the internet can be a really scary and scammy place these days. I will have to say I don't trust half the people who post videos about rescuing animals. I feel like they're staged, but uh, that's just my opinion. Thank you all so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Please subscribe and let me know if I can do anything differently.